why? Why did you buy this t-shirt? Why not buy it? Just a big Lebowski t-shirt. Well, I didn't want to be so obvious about it just like um, saying, having a t-shirt which says the big Lebowski. Um, this way I can, it, it looks like just a normal t-shirt of a band or something, but it's actually um, showing that I'm a fan of the film. I think you were saying by wearing this item? Um, I don't actually wear this item because it's a bit, um, a bit bright for kind of everyday where you wear it for parties really. I just keep it because it's a present and because it kind of reminds me of how it links to Why did you pick something which you don't usually wear out to be your um, cover item, is it? Well I guess because it's just quite special really, it, it's something different than, I wouldn't buy this in a shop if I saw it. And I think that's one of the really nice things about presents, you, you get things that you wouldn't normally buy or wear. My dad went out to buy us all jumpers, he decided we need more jumpers for the winter and my brother came with him because my brother wanted uh, free food and uh, extra games and um, my dad had chosen a jumper at which point my brother decided that was not the jumper I would like and chose a different one and he was right which is interesting. Is this jumper special to you because your brother picked it out? I would say it is special because he picked it out over something else. Um, my necklace, I brought it um, a few years ago in a market in Turkey, in um, southern Turkey, a place called Kalkam. I remember when I brought it, I was at this store which was selling very, very cheap things and I thought it might be nice to buy that. And um, I just remember everyone making fun of me because it was very, it's very cheap and it's very, um, something special. But um, yeah, that's what I thought it might be nice. It reminds me of Turkey, really, and I think, you know, that's a sense of my own identity as being a Turkish person, which is, um, I think, important to me. That's why I chose it. So how did you um, acquire the item? Um, I bought it from H&M. I like the checks on it, and um, it's quite, like, versatile, so I can wear it in the song. I'm not really sure if I'm saying anything. I think that's why I like it, because I'm, I'm not really saying anything. It's, it's not like a big statement, it's just like, I don't know, it makes me feel quite... Yeah, I like that about it, that it's not a big statement. Why is this your favourite item of adornment? I suppose it's my favourite jacket. And it's quite important for me to have such a nice jacket to wear. Because obviously it's the first thing that someone would see when they look at me. And uh, it's quite important to be, of course, warm. And, uh, and it's quite stylish as well. I quite like the removable hood. I chose this necklace because my grandma gave it to me for my 15th birthday. And um, she died a month later, so it means quite a lot to me. It's not the kind of thing I wear out. It's more the kind of thing that I would just keep for memories. Do you think about your grandma when you put it on, or is it just a um, piece of rice? Yeah, it's, yeah, it makes bring up memories and stuff to it's nice. Sometimes it's nice to be kind of different and like stand out and like have people go, whoa, your shoes are quite bright today. I chose shoelaces, but not like specifically these ones necessarily. I sort of just, just my shoelaces in general because like, I don't know, it's quite nice because you can just like change your shoes just by changing your shoelaces. In the morning you can just take your shoelaces out and then put a new pair in. I like started buying shoelaces about like uh, last summer. And I bought them probably in Croydon, I don't know what shop specifically. They're quite like stand out I would say, they're quite a bold statement. Um, normally I, I actually generally don't wear like bright colours.